all is worth, you know. Offense, you know, they want to protect the ball. Defense, we want to take it away. So, that means be valuable. Baltimore's had an elite run game this year. How do you stop them? I mean, everybody just um, do their job, you know, do your 111. Just being, it started with our D line, you know, our D line set the tone, and then the linebackers fit in the gaps and safety fit, fit in the alleys and stuff, running the alleys. We just got to um, do our job, you know, we got to put out the fire early. Knowing how limited possessions are, how critical are the play of the shooting more so after the game, knowing how tough it is to I mean, it's very critical, you know, you, whoever protect the ball, this, this game will win, you know. Um, Lamar is a dynamic quarterback, and then you know you got we got an explosive offense, so we just got to protect the ball. Does it feel like a, a heightened game? Like it, it feels a challenge for the game itself. Y'all have like a lot of this is the Yeah, it's always been this um, way when you play against them. You know, any division game is a, a like a playoff game. You know, we've been here before. We know how how much what's the state. You know what what we got to do. We got to win. What's the biggest I mean, he can do it all now. You know, he can throw the ball. He got guys around him. He got weapons. He got a dynamic run game. They got like one of the most creative run game in the in the NFL. So you got to be able to depend two plays at one time. You got to run it back and run the ball, and he can run the ball. And now he can throw it to anybody down the field. He's sitting in the pocket. He's reading his keys. He's um he um he basically taking full control of this offense. The new the off the new OC is giving him. On a short week like this, I, I know Tuesday becomes more like a Thursday or Friday. Does today feel more like a Tuesday or more like a Thursday or Friday? I mean, I, I say this is the second time playing them, so you know somewhat what they running. So it ain't really like it's just refitching your mind. Like you go back in the chapter of the book, you look at what what they did against us, how they attacked us, you look at that stuff. But they always go back to their true roots of what they do with um, down the stretch, down to the key moments of the game. At some point – Keaton Mitchell has given them a little explosiveness over the past couple of weeks. Yeah. Have you have you noticed him on yeah. film and what's going on? Yeah, you'll you'll notice a guy that's explosive as he as he is. You know, this guy can just take a draw, um, like 40 or 50 yards to the touchdown. That he circled the whole defense, and then you see him getting the screen pass, and being explosive, like 30 yards a pop. So every time he touches the ball, he's dynamic, go the distance. At some point during a short week, does it finally start to feel normal instead of being crunched and condensed like the night before the game or the day of the game? Does it finally start to feel normal at some point? I mean, you, you got to make it feel normal. You got to figure out ways to um, get advantage. You know, you got to study your, um, the game plan even more. You got to watch film more. You got to pay more um, attention to detail and understand the, the game. Do you start watching film quicker after a Sunday game than you would normally when you're heading into a Thursday game? Um, yeah, I'd say after the Sunday game, I watched a little bit after, you know, to see how, what they're doing, how things are different they're doing. They're doing a little bit of stuff different and stuff like that, trying to change up the way defense looking and stuff like that, trying to change the picture. But they still go run the same plays, just different formations, different ways to get getting the guys the ball. You know, he got his guys he want to get the ball to. And then Odell is more getting the ball more now. So we'll, we'll, we'll be right. You mentioned.